Still seeing freezing rain here in Lima. We did see some sleet earlier on that transition in between uh, freezing rain and sleet now. Freezing rain outside, 28 degrees, your current temperature, northeast wind at 10 miles per hour. With those winds, the wind chill factor is at 19 degrees. And temperatures are actually on the rise as we head into the 11 o'clock hour. 33 degrees in Ottawa, 28 in Lima, 31 in Bluffton down to the south. Wapkineta at 29 degrees as well. The freezing point in Bell Fountain at 32 degrees. Winter weather advisory is in effect for the entirety of the viewing area until tomorrow in the morning time, as we expect the system to eventually move out by uh, the uh, work commute tomorrow. And as we look at uh, the satellite radar, we do see that freezing rain down to the southeast. Also snow as well up to the north. I saw a report in Finley, though, that we are starting to see some freezing rain start to fall after it did see some snowfall for much of the evening hours. And this will continue for much of the nighttime as well, eventually transitioning into snow as we go later on in the nighttime. But as we zoom on out, there is that low in the Ohio Valley right now, and it will continue to move northeastward eventually out as we progress through the morning time. Overnight lows not dropping far from where they are right now into the lower 20s, right around 23, 22 degrees as you walk out the door tomorrow. And by the afternoon, a pretty similar day in terms of temperatures. We won't be seeing that snowfall, but right around 29 to 30 degrees. And as we progress through the nighttime, we start to see that rain snow line transition down further to the south. We see more snowfall by 2 a.m. and that will continue for much of the night and eventually moving on out by the morning time. Maybe a few flurries here and there. Uh, that is left from the system by the work commute. But other than that, we do stay dry for the rest of the daytime. Cloudy conditions do continue in the lunch hour and eventually through the afternoon as well. They persist into the night. Your future snowfall, we really are expecting just about another inch or so up in those northern counties, even here into Allen County as well. But down to the south where we are mainly seeing that sleet and freezing rain, we only expect around half an inch or less for the remainder of the night. Your ice forecast, we are still expecting the, uh, the, uh, the quarter of an inch down in those southern counties near Logan County, Shelby County as well. Tonight our low is 22 degrees, snow, sleet, nice. We already are seeing that slick travel conditions. Northeast winds becoming northwest at 10 to 20 miles per hour. Tomorrow the high 29 degrees, some flurries in the morning. Cold and clouds do linger. Winds up to 15 miles per hour. Seven day forecast things do look up from here as we progress through the weekend. Temperatures getting up into 30 degrees by Saturday, 40 by your Sunday. Lots of sunshine this weekend as well. And eventually the work week looks nice as well. At least at start we see those temperatures right around 45 degrees on your Tuesday and Wednesday with some sunshine and clouds mixed in. Katie.